Back in 2016, I made a video called the most dangerous prison inmates in the world and it ended up getting over 15 million views. It wasn't a very good video and it kind of got mixed reviews. At the time when I made this video, I was studying towards my psychology degree and I was doing a module on criminology. So I was reading a lot about criminals and I kind of went down a rabbit hole and started watching a lot of videos on YouTube about the most dangerous prisoners and the most dangerous prisons in the world. Because I like making videos, I decided to make my own video on this topic. So I did and then uploaded it in February of 2016. And for the next few months, I just completely forgot about it. I didn't look at this channel and I didn't check how many views this video was getting. Then a couple of months later in May of 2016, I ended up getting an email from YouTube saying that I'd been paid $300 for the views that this video was getting. And that was kind of a surprise to me. I didn't expect it to get any views. I'd completely forgotten about the channel and this video by that point. But when I went back and checked, I found out that it had been getting hundreds and thousands of views over the last couple of months. So if we jump into the analytics for this video to see how much this video actually made me, you can see that for some reason, the amount of money I was making from this video doesn't seem to show up for the first half of 2016. But from what I remember, I was making a couple of hundred dollars per month from this video, so it was a nice bit of passive income. So if we scroll to mid-July, the money I was making from this video starts to show up. In August, I made $1,000. In September, I made about $500. In October, I made about $700. In November, I made $1,150. And then in December, we had a huge month where I received 3.1 million views and in return got $8,300, which was a nice Christmas bonus. I was really quite lucky to get a lot of views in December because if you don't already know, December has the highest ad rates throughout the year on YouTube. Because so many companies try to promote their products and services at this point in the year, they are actually in competition with each other and end up having to pay more to YouTube to advertise on YouTube. Because YouTubers get paid a direct cut of what YouTube gets paid, when advertisers pay YouTube more, YouTubers end up getting paid more as well. So that's the kind of in a nutshell version of why December is a really good month on YouTube and why I was lucky that this video popped off right then. If we jump back into the analytics and fast forward to 2017 as a whole, you can see that I got an additional 8.2 million views on this video but I only made $1,087 through this entire year. The reason things took such a bad tumble in 2017 is because of something called the adpocalypse. If you don't know what the adpocalypse was, basically back in 2017, a lot of companies stopped advertising on YouTube, which in turn meant ad rates took a massive hit. The reason so many companies stopped advertising with YouTube at this point in time was because they'd become concerned that their adverts were being played alongside content that was kind of risky. Because my content where I spoke about dangerous prisoners and prisons was obviously pretty risky, I started getting limited ads on all of my videos and started just making a tiny amount compared to what I used to make. I went from making roughly $2,500 per million views all the way down to $100 per million views. This is a little bit annoying because I could have easily made an extra $20,000 off this one video if I'd kept getting the same ad rates that I did in 2016 for the views that I got in 2017. So if we add up everything this video made me by looking at the lifetime stats, it showed that I made $12,000 $685.20, but it was probably closer to about $13,500 if we include the money that wasn't showing up in my analytics from February through to mid-July in 2016. Like I said, I could have made a lot more money from this video, so it is a little bit annoying, but I can't really complain just because this is such a great amount of money to have made from a video that only took me a couple of hours to make. If you enjoyed this video and found it interesting, I'd appreciate you dropping a like below, and if you want to see more content from me, then be sure to subscribe and enable notifications. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you all in the next one.